So in this video, we'll see how to solve the Maclaurin series or how to find out the Maclaurin series for the given mathematical function over here. So you can see cos x, we have to find out the Maclaurin series. Okay, so up to up to how many terms you have to find out? Okay, that will be given in the question. If it is not given, then you have to find out at least three four terms. That's it. So let us first write the Maclaurin series. That is nothing but f of x equal to f of zero plus plus f dash of zero x plus f double dash of zero x square by two factorial plus f triple dash of zero x cube by three factorial plus f fourth derivative x power four by four factorial and so on so first thing f of x will be given in the question the function itself that is cos x now we have to find out each terms so here we are going to find out each terms that means f of x we have now we have to find out f of 0 so f of 0 means at place of x we have to put 0 correct that means it will become cos 0 what is cos 0 cos 0 value i hope you know that is 1 now next next i have here f dash of 0 that means first derivative so i have to first find out f dash of x so that will be equal to derivative derivative first derivative means the differentiate this one cos x differentiate f of x in order to get f dash of x so when i differentiate cos x what it will be minus sin x so now i can put f dash of 0 that means in place of x you have to put 0 to so minus sin 0 what is sin 0 it is nothing but 0 so minus doesn't matter minus or plus next the f dash of 0 that means i have to find of f da double dash of uh, second derivative i have to find out so second derivative remember you have to differentiate this one the previous terms you have to differentiate that's it okay so minus sin x differentiating minus you keep it sin x differentiation is cos x so minus is already there okay now i'll find out f double dash of 0 so in place of x 0 so minus cos 0 it will be minus 1 next the third derivative here you can see this part so minus i'll keep it as it is cos x differentiation is minus sin x so again one more minus will come so i can basically put minus into minus plus okay so plus sin x so put f triple dash of zero so sin zero it will be zero next fourth derivative differentiate this one sin x differentiation will be cos x so fourth derivative value at zero constant value at zero it will be cos zero cos zero is nothing but one next i'll find out one more term if you want you can find out okay fifth derivative it will be cos x differentiation will be minus sin x again the same thing you have to put zero so minus sin 0 it will be 0 so like this one you can find out if they mention up to 7 terms 6 terms 4 terms then till there you have to find out that's it so here i have got all the values you have to see only these values correct because in the formula we have only these values you have to directly substitute in the series so f of x equal to f of 0 what is f of 0 value that is nothing but 1 plus f dash of 0 it is 0 correct 0 into x that will be 0 so 0 into x it is 0 plus f double dash of 0 f double dash of 0 is minus 1 so minus 1 and the terms is it is here that is x square by 2 factorial plus next term f triple dash that is this value it is 0 so whole term becomes 0 so no need to substitute here it will become 0 next the fourth term 
that is here we have 1 so I have to put 1 then x power 4 by 4 factorial okay then and so on it will continue okay it will continue so here you can see I will just rewrite this one f of x equal to 1 then 0 no need to consider minus 1 into this one minus x square by 2 factorial then no need to consider this one then plus x power 4 by 4 factorial okay plus so on so this is nothing but f of x that means cos x i have represented it as a power series this is nothing but the power series that means it is nothing but the maclaurin series okay we have found out the series power series through the maclaurin series formula so this will be the final answer